I like your take on boobies. And I like boobies. Our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. With the new season underway, Coach Fratello, you get the sense some teams are still rounding themselves into form. Yeah, especially teams that added a number of new pieces over the summer. It doesn't just all come together instantly. Chemistry takes time and patience to develop. The shot's good from Paxson. A floor spacer who is always ready to fire. Paxson is terrific on catch-and-shoot jumpers. Pass to Reed. Foul, John Paxson. First personal foul. First team foul. Here's Jaminski. Back to Bogues. Six on the shot clock. Johnson the screen. And it's Bogues missing. And here's Grant. He'll bring it up for the Bulls. Outplayed in the previous game on their schedule. Losing to Sacramento. You know, in that last meeting, they just couldn't string together enough stops. Tough to win that way on the road. Yeah, once that crowd gets going, it becomes much tougher to eke out a win. Gill kicks to Bogues. Pass to Reed. Back to Bogues. Tries again, and Grant sends it back. One of the better defenders in this game, Grant teeing off on that. And out of bounds as the Hornets gain possession. The Hornets have gone 0 of 3 from the field to start the game. Here's Bogues. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Even though he's a smaller guard, Bogues is confident inside. Excellent job capitalizing. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. For three, Paxson. And the rebound goes to the Hornets. Last time they met was in Charlotte. You know, when they last played this team, I think they won because of the play of the second unit. The bench really brought it for them. Let's see if they're able to replicate that success here tonight. I'm sure the starters are expecting them to. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three-point play. The Hornets shooting their first free throw of the game right now. Shooting for Charlotte. Three at the line for one. Just about two minutes into the game. First quarter of basketball. Here's Jordan. And the dunk by Jordan. Boy, what a ruthless, wicked dribble move that time by Jordan. Threw his defender off and got the space he needed to fire. Paxson against Bogues. Teardrop shot. Count the basket. I think he's got to show more fight than that. Can't give up on the play once you get screened. You got to continue to fight through. And coach is definitely going to be frustrated with that effort. Or lack of one, that is. Now here's Jordan. 35 points for him last game against the Kings in Sacramento. Here's Grant. Keeps it alive. Great positioning on the putback. Got to keep Purdue off the boards. He will burn you when you don't box him out. Charlotte in the lead. And here's Bogues. Looking at his point production, he averages almost eight points a game. Pippen against Gill. Pippen dishes to Jordan. And a fast break now for the Hornets. Bogues, good. Bogues has got six points. Good instincts from Gill. He spots an open man and makes sure he gets the ball. Chicago's gone 0-2 from deep here. The pass to Purdue. 
Grant outside. Jordan passes to Batson, and it's Pippen in the corner. Paxson against Bogues. The shot's good from Paxson. Paxson's got his second basket of the game. Really good concentration by Paxson that time. I think he drew some contact there, but no whistle. Bogues against Paxson. And there's the try. Bogues good. Now here's Paxson. He averages a bit over six points a game. Pass to Pippen, and taken away by Johnson. Pulls up on the elbow. Chicago grabs the miss. And the D daring him to prove he can make it from that spot. Unfortunately for him, not able there. Stolen by Reed. One on one here. Here's Gill. Great D that time from Jordan. And that's a strong defensive effort to force the miss, especially against someone of his caliber. Wow, throwing it down with some real force. Yeah, big two-handed flush. Two is better than one. The defense knew better than to mess with him on that one. Here's Bowles. The Bulls getting their last shot to go. Here's Jaminski. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Bulls trail by three. Charlotte foul. Reed. First personal foul. First team foul. Michael Jordan on the wing. He's covered by Gill. Here's Paxson. And he makes good on the way. Paxson's got his third basket of the night. The big man, Purdue, possesses a good feel for when to give it up. Paxson against Bogues. Passes it to Gill. Plenty of space. And he hits the jump shot. And I like how versatile he is on offense. Capable of burning defenses in so many ways. Paxson against Bogues. Paxson kicks to Grant. Stolen by Reed. Fast break now for Charlotte. Bogues with it. Now defended by Grant. Some solid defense from Grant. Bulls trail by three. Here's Jordan. And then Jordan slams it in. And what a finisher Jordan is on these slams. Putting on a show for the fans. For Charlotte, they've gone an even 50% from the field. They are 7 of 14 for the game. Unloads from 13. The rebound by Grant. Grant's got four rebounds in this game. Paxson. And too long on the shot. And the D got super lucky he didn't drain that one. Here's Bowles. Charlotte no good that time either. Chicago is gone. 0-2 from deep here. And it's Jordan slamming it down. Boy, outstanding ball movement from Paxson there, showing a willingness to involve his teammates. And the Hornets call time here. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Kings checked in for Purdue. Williams comes in for Horace Grant. Hodges checked in for Jordan. And B.J. Armstrong has subbed in for Paxson. The Hornets also changing it up. Newman's checked in for Reed. Curry comes in for Gill. And it's Grant in four bows. Now here's Curry. Here's Johnson. Rebound by Williams. Armstrong passes to Hodges. It's good. And the Bulls lead by three. And Hodges just knows where to be on offense. Loves getting inside and capitalizing too. Armstrong against Grant. Here's Curry. That one's off. He starts the game with a miss. So for the Hornets, their last game, a win against Los Angeles. Hodges the pass to King. Off with the layup. When you bring it inside, you have to go up strong. Because more often than not, you'll face stiff defense. Showing off his supreme athleticism there. Yeah, Clark with a relatively simple dunk, too. He's just taking care of business. No need for risky moves. And out of bounds as the Hornets gain possession. 
He showed no commitment trying to grab that pass. That kind of lackluster effort is exactly why it results in a turnover. Here's Charlotte. They trail by one. Their last game a win against the Lakers, looking to carry it into this one. And, you know, it wasn't really that close either. They were executing at a high level. Impressed me in multiple phases of the game. They were in peak form. And it's Williams with the ball for Chicago. And Hodges kicks to Pippen. Dishes it to Williams. Back to Pippen. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Points, assists, rebounds, defense. Scotty Pittman gives your team all of that. Every team in the league wants a guy like him. Grant, he's checked in for the Hornets. He doesn't get the second one. Charlotte's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Here's Gill. It's hauled in by the bull. It's Pippen with the drive, and it's Pippen with the jam. Love the take there from Pippen. I like when he seeks out his offense. Hornets trail by four. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Grant against Armstrong. Here's Gill. And count it from 19 feet away. Assist goes to Grant. Here's Chicago. Outside Pippen. Outside Williams. King outside. He kicks it to Armstrong. Williams, a screen on Grant. Trains it from beyond the arc. And the Bulls lead by five. Hey, you've got to defend BJ out there now. He will not hesitate to let that three-pointer fly. The scoring fast and furious as we end the first quarter. Bulls out front, up five. 2K Sports back in a moment here at Chicago Stadium. enjoyed the broadcast so far halfway through the first half in this one and a look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Bulls ever since this game started they've been attacking inside looking for ways to bust up the defense and get high percentage looks cultivating a lot of assists right now which is beautiful to see love the way they're working that ball around a shot he knows so well Gil very confident in his ability to hit from the mid range Hands it from downtown. Armstrong's got the lead up to six now for the Bulls. And he's not someone you want to take lightly from there. The fault lies with the defense for allowing him to get a little bit of wiggle room. Now, here's Grant. Nothing on the board. The shot by Newman, no good. King, the pass to Armstrong. Here's Hodges. Second chance effort. Kicks it to Armstrong. Gill against Jordan. Curry with the steal. And a fast break now for the Hornets. Stops. Pops. And that one's good. Gill. Gill's got four points this quarter. The Bulls leading by four. Pass to Armstrong. Here is Hodges. He's covered by Gill. Jordan is double. Here's Hodges. Six to shoot. They grab their own miss. And there's Jordan putting it right back in. Love how Jordan uses his jumping ability on the offensive boards. I mean, this guy just does not give up. And we're a little over a minute and a half into the second quarter of action. Armstrong against Grant. The pass to Newman. All alone. Good, and Grant gets the assist. Grant's got three assists tonight. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. Oh, oh strong whoa. finish. <laughs> Throw that thing down. Woo. Using his tremendous strength and body control, Jordan shrugs off the contact and gets the shot to fall. Has to Gill. Chicago grabs the miss. 
Williams has got four rebounds now tonight. Here's Jordan. Back to King. The Hornets pull it in. Following this one, they get to host the Mavericks. It's Curry with the drive. Good tee by Williams. The Bulls leading by six. Jordan is double. Here's Hodges. Here's King. And that's good. A nice job in the glass as they pick up two on the second effort. Crashing the offensive glass with power. King. This is why you got to put a body on him. Grant against Armstrong. This is it to Gill. Puts it up. And it's King with the rebound. Chicago's gone one of three from way outside since the start of the second quarter. Up again. It's good on the putback. And the Bulls lead by 10. How about that? Some volleyball skills out there. Yeah, good word to use. Just tapping it up and tapping it again. That takes great coordination. They swipe it. Armstrong dishes to Jordan. Gaddison grabs the miss. Defense made an impact right there. Definitely got him uncomfortable going up with it. Outside Curry from outside the arc trains the three-pointer. And Commissioner David Stern expanding the NBA's reach, Mike. Last season, it was the first North American sports league to hold regular season games overseas. And it got a lot of attention. Yeah, the Jazz and Suns facing off in Tokyo. Stern also pushing for NBA players to take part this summer in Barcelona. That would be a dream come true. So Charlotte calls timeout. They're first. Michael Jordan really making a difference here. He's really taking it to him inside. They got to find a way to slow him down. Purdue is checked in for King. Grant comes in for Williams. Scotty Pippen's checked in for Hodges. And it's Paxson in for B.J. Armstrong. Here's Bogues. The teardrop falls in. Bogues has got 10 points in the game. Beautiful touch that time from Bogues. Pippen the pass to Purdue. Bogues against Paxson. Banked in off the glass. He's got eight. You know, coaches will take possessions like that all day long. Phenomenal use of the screen there. Bogues against Paxson. Pass to Gill. Shoots over Jordan. Gill misses. The Bulls leading by nine. And it's Pippen in the corner. Grant outside. Here's Jordan. Jordan is double. Down to five on the shot clock. To the right side. Here's Purdue. And stolen by Bogues. Out to the right wing. Newman the pass to Jaminski. Chicago foul. John. And some changes here for the Hornets. Johnson, he's checked in for Newman. And Curry subbed in for Gill. Substitution for the away team. Larry Johnson. Johnson, the pass to Jaminski. Paxson against Bogues. Just five to shoot. The Hornets need to get a shot off here. Over Paxson. Charlotte again missing. Boy, the defense just smothered that one. Drape all over him. Outstanding effort to contest without fouling. Jordan, the pass to Paxson. Off target from three-point range. Oh, Charles, Horace, Grant. Only a second personal foul. Second team foul. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for Charlotte. Nine-point game. Bogues. And he banks in the lane. Bogues has got 12 points in the game. 
Coming up large, this has been Bogues' night. Jordan on the wing, guarded by Kerr. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. Muggsy Bogues picks one up. And he's got his first free throw of the game. First free throw is good. What I like about Paxson is that he knows his role. Doesn't play outside of himself. B.J. Armstrong's checked in for Michael Jordan. So after making the first, he goes one for two. Hornets trail by eight. Floats one. Bogues, good. Bogues has got six in the quarter. Great recognition to read the D and go with the floater. Beautiful touch. Armstrong with it, and it's Johnson picking him up. And that one's good by Pippen. Nice shot off the catch there. Pippen shows you a little bit of everything every night. Bogues against Armstrong. Bogues the pass to Reed. Now here's Johnson. Over Pippen. And with that, the Chicago lead is cut down to six points. That one good from Johnson. Nice touch from the mid-range. Johnson, you can tell how much he likes this area. It's stolen by Curry. Baseline J on the way. Got a piece of it. And that's out of bounds. Charlotte will retain possession. Gill is checking in for Curry. Number 13, Kendall Gill. 153 left to play here in the half. Johnson, the pass to Gill. Lock at six. Johnson with a screen on Armstrong. Bogues dishes to Johnson. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. For a rookie, Johnson's a very smart offensive player. He's a terrific guy to use in the pick and roll. Pippen, the pass to Purdue. Here's Pippen. He's guarded by Johnson. Here's Bulls. Finished off the break. And now just a two-point Bulls lead. The floor awareness of Johnson on display. Fantastic pass to the open man. Pippen kicks to Grant. And it's denied. And he gets it back. Johnson against Pippen. Here's Armstrong into the lane. That falls nicely on the feed that time from Pippen. While he might have a slight frame, Armstrong can take a bump and still finish. Not loose. Paxson outside. Here's Grant. He feeds it to Armstrong. Here's Paxson. And Jaminski pulls it down. Hornets trail by four. Here's Gill. He's got eight. Over to the wing. Bogues with it. Doesn't go for him. And that'll do it for the first half. A competitive game so far. Bulls lead by four. Live from Chicago Stadium, you're watching 2K Sports. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. One guy who's been getting it done is Bugsy Bowes. And, you know, his scoring in the first half, a pleasant surprise for his team. Not a player who's usually at the top of the scouting report, but it's been his night. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. The pass to Gill. Pass to Reed. Shot clock at six. And it's Chicago with the rebound. 
Purdue's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Grant and the dunk by Grant. This is the winning mindset Jordan brings to his team. Enjoys feeding his open teammates. Hornets trail by six. Passes to Jaminski. Goes back up. The rebound by Pippen. And Chicago has possession. They've led by as much as 10. That'll be just one game played away from home for them. Hornets have gone 0-3 and are still looking for that first bucket here in the second half. Bogues against Paxson. Kicks it out to Johnson. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Now we get a chance to check out the standings out east already. We are in December. Taking a look at the Hornets. They were hoping to get off to a better start to the season. Things are still early, so they still may have a chance. And, of course, Chicago sitting directly below him, just one spot down. For three, Paxson. He can't get it to go. Hornets trail by six. Bogues the pass to Jaminski. Here's Gill, and he drives in. In it goes for the fifth time in ten shots for him this game. That kind of defense isn't going to get it done, especially when it comes to a score of his caliber. And the shot is good. And right now, MJ has it going on. His teammates should just continue to get him the rock. Gill against Grant. Here's Gill. Ten points for him. Here's Johnson, and he converts the layup. Six points for Johnson. Exactly what you want to see from Johnson. Dependable inside play. Chicago calls timeout. Now around two minutes gone by in this half. Grant finds Pippen. Driving inside. That one good for two. Pippen's got nine points. For his position, Grant has good vision with the ball. I mean, he can find open guys. Maxson against Bogues. Throws it up high. Stolen by Grant. And now here's Pippen with the fast break chance. With all the different things Pippen can do, Scotty is one of the toughest matchups in the NBA. First team. The Bulls have split their free throws right down the middle so far. They're two for two. Scotty Pippen, two shots. First one falls. And so he hits both. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Bogues against Paxson. Pass to Gill. 
got a piece of it. And now here's Jordan pushing it up, and no one back there. Tell you what, Jordan, such a strong defender. Outstanding at reading the opposition and pouncing on those steals. And now the first timeout called here for the Hornets. The interior defense has been very subpar, and I bet their coach is letting them know about it. Allowing far too many points in the painted area, they need to put forth more of an effort defensively. Here's Gill. Ten points for him. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. It falls through, making him six for 11 in the game. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Back to Pippen. There's the pass to Paxson to the left side wing. Here's Jordan. Good, and Grant gets the assist. Grant's got three assists now in this one. Clever with the floater. Man, does Jordan know how to torture defenses. Driving the lane. And it will go, and the Bulls' lead is cut down to eight on the bucket from Muggsy Bowes. And he's trying to carry this offense, but he can't do it alone. These guys need to help him. Pass to Pippen. Jordan against Gill. Passes it to Purdue. For three, Paxson. That's in for his fifth field goal of the game. Makes him five for 12 so far. Looks like Paxson is feeling competitive. Answering that last three with a bomb of his own. Pass to Gill. Six to shoot. Pulls up, high post. That's his sixth miss and 12 field goal attempts. Paxson passes to Jordan. And the layup is good. Jordan's got 20 points. Some contact won't hold Jordan at bay. He gets aggressive and gets through it. Hornets trail by 13. Now Bowles. He's got 18. And there's the pass to Gill. The rebound by Purdue. Purdue's got his sixth rebound on the night. Jordan dishes to Grant. And the dunk by Grant. Hey, just putting in the work. Doing the job. Grant does this every night. Rarely takes a game off in terms of his effort and tenacity. Back to Bogues. Plays it up off the glass. Bogues has got four points in the quarter. Outstanding distribution there. I mean, what impressive passing ability. Jordan deciding where to go with it. Pass to Paxson. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Michael Jordan on the wing. Covered by Johnson. The three, Pippen. Larry Johnson grabs the miss. Johnson's got five rebounds tonight. And then Johnson with the dunk. Not many tougher than Johnson around the rim. Potential to dominate down there. Pippen kicks to Jordan. And a fast break now for the Hornets. Pushing it up. Now that's how to finish the break. Throw down with force. Easy points off the steal. Those baskets help you get back into games. The Bulls leading by nine. Jackson passes to Purdue. And again, Chicago. No good. For Charlotte, they've gone 7 of 12 from the floor since coming out of the break. Johnson outside. And here's Bowes. He's got 20. Lock at 6. Now here's Reed. He's covered by Grant. Reed misses. The Bulls have gotten 8 of their 11 shots to drop since the break. A great third quarter for them offensively. Paxson outside, fires the three. A rebound by Larry Johnson. Johnson's got six rebounds in the game. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes 
Hill kicks to Johnson. And slam dunk by Johnson. Ah, the exuberance of youth. Johnson elevating and wowing the crowd with that one. And now the first time out called here for the Bulls. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Here. Kings checked in for Purdue. Williams comes in for Horace Grant. Hodges checked in for Michael Jordan. And B.J. Armstrong has subbed in for Paxson. And so it's Pippen with it. He brings it up for the Bulls. Outside Williams. To the middle. Here's King. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Great find by Williams that time. Always nice to get some playmaking out of your front court. Armstrong against Grant. Pass to Kerr. No one near him. Good, and Grant gets the assist. Grant's got his fourth assist in this one. Side Pippen. Misses the layup. He had him with that bump thing. Seemed as if he had the angle to finish, but the defense did just enough to throw him off. Boy, that's a high IQ play on defense there. That's a spot where you want to foul. Send the message. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for the Hornets. Their defensive intensity has served them well. It's kept the offense scrambling and resulted in several steals. The shooting's been great, but also how about the energy level? That's what's impressed me the most. They've been getting it up and down in transition, and that takes effort. Gill is checked in for Charlotte. Here's Newman. Rebound by Williams. The Bulls leading by eight. It's Pippen with a drive. Shoots over Curry. And down it goes. Dunk threw off a wonderful assist. Fantastic job getting this kind of a look at the rim. King flushes it home whenever he can. Charlotte shooting at 50% in a decent groove. Pass to Gaddison. Cloak loose. It's Pippen on the win. 12 points for him. A noble effort to take the charge, but I don't think he was quite set there. Yeah, you could see him still leaning just a bit. Tough foul to take. Six attempts for him at the line. He's made four. Two shots. And he can't hit the second. Hornets trail by 11. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Newman, and he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. Easy buckets like that. Just what the doctor ordered to get them back into this ball game. They need something to light that fire, and that, you're right, may be it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right to the rim and left nothing to chance with the dunk. Stay aggressive. I don't ever like to see teams pump the brakes when they've got the lead. Stay aggressive, attack a fantastic way to pad your cushion. Absolutely. You know a run is coming. Here's Gill, and that would have counted, but his uh, shot was off the mark this time. And here at the end of the third quarter, it's a double-digit ball game. It's Chicago. They're up by 11. 2K Sports back in a moment here at Chicago Stadium. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. And it's the Bulls with the ball. They lead by 11. Armstrong passes to Hobson. The dish now to Jordan. Here's King. And down it goes, jamming that one home. The body control from King. He's adept at overcoming tough defense like this. Here are the Hornets with the ball. Grant outside. Outside Curry. Wide open. Good, and Grant gets the assist. Grant's got his sixth assist on the night. Excellent vision on display. Dropping a dime to set up his teammate. And the powerful one-handed slam. 
and hopefully that one-handed dunk gets him going. I think that's why he went for it. These guys need a boost, don't they? Yep, especially in a game this close. No question. And the pass to Gill. I vote shot, and Charlotte again with the bucket. Assured shooting from Gill. That's exactly what you want out of a swing player. Michael Jordan on the wing. And they double up Jordan. I'll tell you what, if they're going to try to get back and even the score in this one, playing soft defense like that is not the recipe. Oh, I agree. Yeah, there was a serious lack of rim projection on that play for sure. And for a coach, there's nothing more maddening than allowing wide open looks at the rim. Williams with the block. Good anticipation by the big man that time. Williams saw it early and got the block. It's Chicago with another bucket. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Bulls. Phenomenal work on the defensive end so far. That stands out the most. They've made it their mission to block shots and make things hard for the opposition. You also can't ignore the good job they've done rebounding on the offensive end tonight. That hustle has been well rewarded with second chance points. Hobson passes to King. And a strong finish with two hands. Go ahead, big fella. Make them feel you. <laughs> Hammer it home. Oh, he still knows how to finish, doesn't he? Well, you love it when bigs play big. Overpowering move right there. Charlotte calls timeout. John Paxson, he's checked in for Chicago. Hornets trail by 17. Outside Curry. Pass to Newman. Over Jordan. That one a little long. And here's Williams now. He'll bring it up for the bowl. 17-point lead, their biggest. Inside runner. It's rebounded by Charlotte. One-on-one -on -one fast break. Curry's shot is good. Curry's got four points now in the quarter. Sticking to the basics. Hey, the fundamentals never go out of style. No reason to risk the fast break on a showboat shot. Absolutely agree. Just take those easy points when you can get them. And there's the call on Michael Jordan. That is his first foul of the game. Personal foul. First team foul. Quarter keeps moving right along. Three minutes gone so far. Gill against Paxson. Passes to Curry from downtown. Jordan is an aggressive defender now. Excels at getting into his man and making things hard. Down low. Uncovered. That shot's good from Gaddison. Nice job hitting him right in stride. Excellent play. Chicago leading by 13. Jordan, the pass to King. Boom, he chains it straight down. And we've come to expect this from him. Filling it up in effortless fashion this quarter. We've played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Ball's knocked loose, and the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Jordan. And some changes here for the Hornets. Reed, he's checked in for Gaddison. Johnson comes in for Newman, and it's Bogues in for Curry. Here's Jaminski. Pass to Gill. On the wing, Johnson, guarded by Jordan. Six on the shot clock. They set the screen. That's tipped, and they recover it. Here's Jaminski. The third shot of the possession finally falls for him. Just a touch more aggression on the defensive glass, and that could have been prevented. Yeah, they've got to get physical if they want to prevent those second-chance looks. Here's Jordan. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Larry Johnson picks one up. Smart play that time by Jordan. Using the pump, baiting the defender, and he bit. He misses the free throw. Some changes for Chicago. Purdue, he's checked in for King. Livingston comes in for Williams. And Scotty Pippen is subbed in for Armstrong. Hornets trail by 14. 
Now here's Bogues. Now the pass to Reed. Pass to Johnson. Shoots over Pippen. Here's Jaminski. Outside to Bogues. Johnson outside. To the paint. Here's Reed. That's in there. Johnson with the assist. Don't be fooled by LJ's size. 6'6", 250 pounds. You can run your offense through Johnson. Tremendous passer. Nice feel for the game. Banging it down with a 40. And Clark, I think, in the process, sending a little message by hanging on the rim. Yeah, they're trying to assert themselves right now. Chicago making a switch here. Grant's checked in. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Well, Kevin, I had a chance to find out what Charlotte's coach was going over with his guys. He told his team they're being too reckless with the ball. He said, you're turning it over left and right. You've got to be smarter and more in control out there. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. Here's Johnson. That shot is off. Nice D from Pippen. Jordan passes to Paxson. Gets it to go. That one good from Purdue. And the Bulls lead by 16. Look at that work rate. Given the second effort to get the score off the miss. Paxson against Bogues. Passes it to Gill. Over Jordan. And that one's good. Gill. Gill's got four points this quarter. And Bogues is a crafty passer. Excellent court awareness and has a real knack for finding the open man. And Jordan throws it down. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Priority and goal number one has to be tightening up the defense. They can't afford to give him open looks. And the call will be against Scottie Pippen. That's his first foul. Johnson the screen. Lock at six. Hexen with the steal. Here's Pippen. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. How about the strength of Pippen? Allowed him to get that shot off while still taking the contact. Line for Chicago. Scotty Pippen. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. And both free throws good for Pippen. Hornets trail by 18. Bogues with it. Pass to Reed. And there's the call on Michael Jordan. That'll be his second foul of the game. Personal foul. Third team foul. And Charlotte turns it over again. And so Jordan will bring it up for Chicago. 18 points separating the teams. That's the biggest lead of the game. Pippen. And the Bulls with another miss. Charlotte has gone 0-3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. Rebound by the Bulls. Grant's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Pippen, the pass to Jordan, and he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. We all know about Michael's offensive prowess, okay? But he's incredible defensively as well. He works hard at that end, and that's rare for a star. Hornets trail by 20. Now, Bowes on the wing, Johnson. Shoots from the right block. Six for ten with that shot going in. That's a good game for a lot of guys. You can tell he scanned the whole floor and found the exact right guy to feed. Chicago calls timeout. They're ahead by 18. There's 138 left to play in the final quarter. Pippen. 
Pippen kicks to Jordan. Jordan is doubled. Picked off in midair. Coming out here tonight and making a statement. Really good work all around for the Bulls. They did take higher percentage shots throughout, and Clark had paid off for them. Yeah, it sure did. I mean, I love the patience leading to that consistency shooting the ball. I mean, those things go hand in hand. Patience, good passing, and good shooting. And during the long NBA season, each contest important here tonight. Tonight's win will give them four on the season. And what a tremendous standout performance it was for Jordan. And, you know, there was no stopping him tonight. Whenever he got the ball, he was looking to score, and rightly so. Such a strong passing game. If you get open, Bogues will find the way to feed you. Jordan outside. There's 48 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And he drew the blocking foul. He'll go to the line for two. And the first one at the line is good. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Bill Carpenter, he's checked in for Purdue. Livingston comes in for Horace Grant. Reed, he's checked in for Pippen. And B.J. Armstrong has subbed in for John Paxson. Grant surveying the D. And there's the pass to Curry. Over Jordan. Rebound by the Bulls. 30 seconds left in the fourth quarter. The three. Reed misses. And the Hornets with possession here. They trail by 18. Newman. Good on the baseline, Jay. Assistant, Del Curry. Outside, Jordan. And sometimes, Jordan's impossible to guard, which forces the D to foul him. First one falls for him. And so Jordan nails both of them. And here is Grant. And the foul called on Michael Jordan. That's his third foul of the game. Third personal foul. Fourth team foul. Coming onto the floor for and so Chicago takes this one. And by a big margin. Like we expected the game could be a blowout. And, <laughs> and that's exactly what we got. <laughs> this team is hard enough to beat on the road, but at home, they take it to another level. And that'll do it, folks. Mark Kellogg, Mike Fratello, and David Aldridge, and the rest of our 2K team. This is Kevin Harlan signing off. So long.